question. How do I determine if this equation is a linear function or a nonlinear function? Answer. The variable x must be either degree 0 or degree 1, and the variable y must be first degree in order to be a linear function. Examples. y equals 2x minus 3. Both x and y are first degree. 4x plus 5y equals 20. Both x and y are first degree. 2x minus 4y equals 7 plus 3x. All variables are first degree. y equals negative 1. x is degree 0 and y is first degree. This makes a horizontal line, which is a function of x. If variable x is first degree, but the variable y has a degree of 0, it will be a linear relation, but not a function of x. Example, x equals 4. The graph is a vertical line and is not a function of x. If variable y is first degree, but the variable x has a degree other than 0 or 1, it will be a nonlinear function of x. Examples y equals x2 plus 25. x is not the first degree. y equals 5x plus 2 minus x3. x is third degree. y equals 1 over x or y equals x minus 1. x is to the power of minus 1. y equals the square root of x or y equals x to the half. x is to the half power. The graph is half a sideways parabola. y equals 2x. x is the exponent instead of the base, so the graph is exponential and not linear. If variable y is not first degree, the relation will not be a function of x. Example, x2 plus y2 equals 4. Neither x nor y is first degree. The graph is a circle with a radius of 2. x equals y2. y is not first degree. This is a sideways parabola.